Yo, what's up, YouTube? This is your boy, Junior, a.k.a. Smoking Guns, out here in Tucson, Arizona, representing the Ultimate Trainer. Want to give a big shout-out to my gyms out here, Boxing Incorporated on the east side, and another huge shout-out to my other gym out here, Apex Mixed Martial Arts on 1st and Fort Lowe. And I have to give a huge shout-out to my sponsor, AI Sports Nutrition, hooking it up with all kind of supplements, all kind of goodies for me to be able to bring to you guys for your reviews and all that different stuff, you know what I mean? So uh, today's topic uh, is not any kind of review or anything like that. Uh, I actually wanted to bring to you guys a workout video this week, but I was kind of sick uh, the last half of last week, so I wasn't able to get any kind of workout videos because I wasn't able to work out like... Uh, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, my workouts was kind of lacking, so I wasn't able to get it in. But uh, thank God, you know what I'm saying? I'm nice and healthy right now, so I'm actually going to be getting a, a hardcore workout right after this video, you know what I mean? So uh, the number one topic that I'm going to talk about today is uh, one thing that's uh, been brought to my attention, especially when I got out the junk, and I see a lot on the YouTube, you know what I'm saying? One of the number one big YouTubers on YouTube talking about it, Kelly Muscle, you know what I'm saying? He's probably got more uh, experience in this than uh, anybody else that's been on the YouTube, you know what I mean? And uh, pretty much what that topic is, is how is it that fools in prison be getting all swelled the hell up without any kind of supplements, without any kind of... Uh, protein, creatine, all of that crazy stuff that foods be having here on the outside, you know what I'm saying? But yet still, they still able to get all swelled up, you know what I mean? And uh, don't have any kind of supplements to work with, all right? Now, I've seen a couple of YouTubers, you know what I'm saying? They brought up some really good... Uh, uh, points on it, you know what I'm saying, you know, like the testosterone because ain't nothing but dudes and stuff like that uh, Some fools, uh, they be getting uh, 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 Performance enhancing drugs in prison, you know what I mean uh, This and that commissary, which all those can play a big factor, you know what I'm saying, while you're in prison But it's one thing that a lot of people aren't even talking about and I only seen maybe a few commenters talking about it And I was actually surprised that they got the gist of it more than the actual YouTubers themselves and it's this, when you in prison, you ain't got nothing else to do but work out, eat, and sleep, all right? Those are the number three things that you need to do to build damn muscle, all right? You work out hard, you sleep, getting proper amount of rest, and you damn eat good. You know what I mean? You eat good, getting all your protein intake and all that, getting your calorie intake. You work your ass off up in the gym, lifting the weights. Or if you're in the state, you're lifting bodies, you know what I mean? Or doing uh, push-ups, pull-ups, and dips, you know what I'm saying? Which, dude, push-ups, pull-ups, and dips can do wonders for your body. And a lot of people be sleeping on that, you know what I mean? And uh, pretty much, that's all you need. Eat, sleep, and work out. And in prison, you doing that all damn day. You know what I'm saying? All the fools that you be seeing that go to prison and get out ripped as hell or get out super swole, that's pretty much all they doing for half of the damn day. It's eating, sleeping, and working out. That's all you need. Don't get me wrong. There is performance enhancing drugs in prison. You know what I'm saying? There's everything in prison. You get uh, steroids. You can get creatine. You can get pretty much. And you, I mean, you get weed, ecstasy heroin, you can get anything you want in prison, you know what I'm saying, because it gets smuggled in, but at the same time, not everybody that gets out of prison all super swelled up be on steroids and all that other crap, man, you know what I'm saying, pretty much all they do all damn day is, like I said, these three things, eat, work out, sleep, all right, just those three things will get you swelled the hell up in prison. All right. And just so you uh, know what I'm talking about, this was my regimen when I was in prison. You know what I'm saying? I was in prison for two years for a lot of you that don't know. You know what I'm saying? And uh, pretty much my regimen was 5.30, 5.45 in the morning. We would get up. You know what I'm saying? Me and my homie, we'd go out to the yard, work out fast to cardio for 30 minutes. You know what I'm saying? After that, we go and eat. Rest for about an hour. Go back out to the yard do another hour of cardio then we would uh do medicine ball drills for an hour building lean muscle burning fat what we do after that we go and eat rest for about another hour then we go back out to the yard uh, be lifting the weights for like an hour to damn near two hours you know what i'm saying and then even after that sometimes we would be doing certain calisthenic exercises doing 1500 push-ups or doing hella pull-ups or doing dips and stuff like that then what do you do after that you go and eat 
So you got to think of it like this. We pretty much working out from 5 45, 6 o'clock in the morning, all the way to about 4 30 to 5 o'clock in the afternoon, doing nothing but lifting weights, doing nothing but, but doing cardio, eating, and resting. And we was getting swelled the hell up. I had a whole weight car where we was getting swelled the hell up, eating, working out, resting, and we was all swelled up. We looked like a bunch of damn Ninja Turtles up in that damn thing, you know what I'm saying? And just so you can see what I'm talking about, I got a picture of myself when I was up in the damn junk. And in this pic, I was only 168. I'm, I'm bigger now, literally, but I almost look bigger when I was in prison than I, I do now. This is a pic of me in prison at 168. All right, swelled the hell up, looking like a damn ninja turtle, okay? And this is another pic of me in my weight car. A, well, a few fools in the weight car and a couple of the fools that wanted to be in the weight car but used to be slacking sometime. Right here. This homie right here, that dude right there, he was actually the head of the weight car when I first got locked up up in there. And they actually accepted me into the weight car because they saw my work ethic. And they was pretty much, yo, if you want to work out with anybody, you can work out with me and the homie. So I ended up joining his weight car. And this fool right here used to make me look small. He had a damn six-pack, eight-pack that made my damn six-pack look like garbage. You know what I'm saying? And that fool used to be repping my damn max which was actually disheartening to me, but at the same time, it was actually very, very motivating to me because it made me want to get stronger and bigger at the same time, just like he was, you know what I'm saying? So, all these pre-notions about, you know, foods like Cali Muscle, you know what I'm saying? If he's on steroids, I can't really call that, you know what I'm saying? But at the same time, I know foods that was swelled up like his ass up in prison, and I know for a fact they wasn't on steroids. They was huge as hell, but they was down for like 10, 15 years too. You know what I'm saying? Them food was down for years. They ain't got nothing to do but eat, eat, sleep, and work the hell out. You know what I'm saying? And them foods are real, damn, just damn, just engorged with muscle. But the foods that I was messing with, dude, wasn't none of us on steroids. And I was messing with some huge, huge dudes. Okay? So that's pretty much the topic for the day you know what i'm saying hopefully that nullify a bunch of the different stuff that's going around but i mean it's very easy i mean a lot of fools is like yeah testosterone plays a part because you want a uh prison full of dudes you know what i'm saying so everybody's trying to everybody got that testosterone up there which does play a part you know what i'm saying but that actually helps you motivate to just want to work out but that doesn't mean that it makes you that much bigger because testosterone yeah it will play a part but that doesn't mean everybody up in there is getting all swelled up and huge and huge and stuff like like that number three things rest eating and working out if you don't have if you did that like let's say you quit your normal job you quit your normal job and you do nothing all day but eat sleep and work out I guarantee you will get huge you will be damn muscled out of your damn mind frame okay so hopefully that put a lot of that other BS to, uh, to rest right there, you know what I'm saying, about why people up in prison be getting all swelled up, you know what I'm saying? Like I said, uh, dude, eat, sleeping, and working out does wonders, all right? So I hope you guys uh, enjoyed the video. I hope that answers a lot of questions. If you guys have any other questions, make sure you hit me up on my messenger and make sure you hit up my Facebook. Make sure you hit up my Instagram. You know what I'm saying? Make sure you subscribe to the link below. You know what I mean? To my channel. You know what I'm saying? I got a bunch more videos coming out, supplement reviews. I got another workout program that I'm going to be putting up next week or actually this uh, later this week, all right? So uh, hopefully that answers a lot of questions out there. Make sure you get at me, all right? Holler at your boy.